Hi friends, welcome to Biology Exams for you.com. Today we are going to discuss about what is an effective population size and how to calculate effective population size. A very common question in many competitive exams of biological science. So let's start with what is an effective population size. So let's take an example. Suppose this is a tiger population in a region of a forest. So total population size refers to the total number of individuals in that population, including both adults and cubs. Here the number is 7. Whereas effective population includes only the number of breeding adults in the population. In this figure, the adults are these three. So while calculating effective population, only this much is considered. So that's the basic difference between effective population size and total population size. Now let us work out some problems to find out effective population size. What is the effective population size for a group of 100 tigers that has 50 breeding males and 50 breeding females? So the equation for finding out effective population size is Ne is equal to 4 into Nm into Nf by Nm plus Nf, where Ne is the effective population size, Nm is the number of breeding males and Nf is the number of breeding females. Let us substitute the values. Here it will be 4 into 50 into 50 by 50 plus 50 as, as the number of breeding males is 50 and also number of breeding females is 50. And the answer will be 100. So here the total population size is equal to effective population size in this example. Remember normally in a large population effective population size will be always lesser than the total population size as there will be non-adults in a population. Now let us take one more example. In a population of 500 with a 50-50 sex ratio and all individuals breeding However, 250 females spread with 10 males, then what will be the effective population size? Let us substitute the values in that equation. The equation is N e is equal to 4 Nm Nf by Nm plus Nf. So just considering the number of breeding males, it is 10. The number of breeding females, it is 250. So 4 into 10 into 250 by 10 plus 250, that is 10,000 by 260 and we'll be getting 38.5 approximately. So it's very simple if we know the formula for finding out effective population. 